But my question is, how did that happen? How was it that suddenly everyone in the world was saying music has charms to soothe the savage beast when it was written for us? I don't know. At some point, someone misspoke, and it just caught on. How do things like that catch on? Mom, please, you're driving me crazy. I mean, did some guy, like, say it at a big rally of some sort, and everyone went home and started saying it that way, and then it just spread from there? Yes, exactly. Oh, now you're just trying to shut me up. Oh, my God. What? Look. Wow. Empty. Just one of those weird lulls happens occasionally. Oh, can we sit wherever we like? Wherever you like. Wow. Such luxury. I never dreamed of. Where do you want to sit? I don't know. Um, how about this table with its unobstructed westward view of the wide cosmopolitan expanse of Clump Street? Tempting. Do you know that on a clear day you can see all the way to the garbage cans behind Al's pancake world? Hmm. Or we could sit in the corner, you know, the mafia table, so that no one can come up behind you and whack you with a cannoli. Whack you with a cannoli? Oh, because he left the gun and took the cannoli. You're so my daughter. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> hey, let's sit at the counter. No, the counter, those are not the power seats. Yes, but with no one here, we can sit at either end and play bagel hockey. Oh, bagel hockey, oh boy. Just sit at a table. Oh, you're awfully rude for a guy who only has two paying customers. Okay, 3.30 on Friday, my debate at Chilton. Write it down. Already written. Good. You prepared? Please. Paris has us beyond prepared. I now know more about doctor-assisted suicide than I ever cared to. Cheery topic. Luke's. Uh-huh. Hold on a second. It's for you. What? Yep. But who knows we're here? This whole morning has been a little Twilight zone -y. Or Outer limitsy. What? Great show, just as eerie, same era, but no one ever references it. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, I don't speak geek. Yep, stepped right in it. Hello? Rory? Lane, how did you know I was here? Telescope. I got a clean shot at Luke's. I saw you and your mom go in. Hey, watch it. Yeah, duck, Harvey. So I guess you're still grounded over that whole Henry thing, huh? Are you kidding? It's the mother of all groundings. My mom's done everything but slap a Dr. Dre ankle bracelet on me. I'm not even going to school. Isn't it illegal to keep a kid out of school? Well, she talked all my teachers into allowing me to be homeschooled for two weeks. I believe the words highly contagious were bandied about. I only get five minutes a day of outside phone time. But unlimited time to call the Psalm a day line. A big ripoff, by the way, because Psalm 79 has been on there for three straight days. That's not in keeping with what their name clearly implies, which is a new Psalm per day, every day. Not the same tired one from the previous two days. I've never heard anyone get so riled up about Psalms before. My world has become very small. Okay, I'm dying for news. Give me some headlines. Uh, well, I've got a debate coming up, and um, Dean's been working extra hours lately, saving up for a new motorcycle, so I hardly see him. Mom and I haven't done laundry in three weeks, but I have taken to jumping into the gigantic pile of dirty clothes while we play our Reader's Digest world's famous polka CD that we got used for 99 cents. Sorry if that's all boring. Are you kidding? It's the most stimulation I've gotten in a week. Lay, come down for your snack. It's tea and Melba toast time. Gotta go. Don't forget me in my solitude. Never. Bye. Think fast. Oh, impressive. <laughs> Were you thinking what I'm thinking? What? Goalie for the bagel hockey team. And bump Schmitty? Schmitty's over the hill. He's washed up. Put him in Cooperstown. Suit up, kid. Call me if anyone sane walks in.